May the 21st, 2013. The Oklahoma Stormnado spread destruction like a two-mile-wide lawnmower blade. Amid down power lines, hissing gas pipes, pulverizing a vast swath of the Oklahoma City suburbs, leveling entire neighborhoods, causing immense devastation, rating a 4 on the enhanced fugitive scale, packing gusts of up to 200 miles per hour, which at this strength can pick up vehicles and buildings and even causing serious damage to steel reinforced structures. This has turned out to be one of the worst disasters in American history. Killing so far up to a hundred people, about 30 of them being children. Damages so far estimated are in the billions. The Stormnado literally ravaged and destroyed everything in its path, leaving behind a trail of what used to be homes, schools, gas stations, workplaces, etc. Lake Granbury Christian Temple for cover because we started to hear the sirens. Joining me now is the pastor of this church. He's been here for 11 years. Uh, Dean Porter, can you please tell me you were having Bible study and then all of a sudden what did you see outside? Yes, we were having Bible study over in our fellowship hall in the building next door and the reports were that tornadoes were uh, potential, obviously, and the, it continued to escalate to the point to where the hail started to come down. So we dismissed the Bible study and came next door to our youth hall where it was a brick building and, and just began to monitor it at that particular point. It was about 15, 20 minutes later watching out the front porch, um, we began to see what looked to be a circular formation in, in the front of the parking lot and it began to suck up debris into it. Um, I ran inside and had gotten our people and our children into, uh, into a safer location in the building. Apparently what had happened from that point was that the tornado had formed over us, touched down on the opposite end of our property where there was a horse stable and some other buildings that were demolished. Just past that point there was a gas uh, plant, I think there was a pipeline that had broke. Previously published May the 6th, 2013, with embedded date. Also posted by beforeitsnews.com, May the 6th, 2013. Prophecies in Revelation, May 5th, 2013. Revelation, May 5th, 2013. In a vision, a church leader preaches, then suddenly began to run. He said he had an accidental call, not accidentally called 911. Outside a window, the trees shook. No one is aware of exactly what is happening. Shortly here, thereafter, a long line of people wait for either food and medical supplies. Interpretation, a major storm will shake the U.S. shortly.